This is a good morning. My name is Yasir Khan and you are watching Mechanical Museum. So today I will show you about the function of the mechanical equipment so like pump, compressor, turbine, compressor also reciprocating, rotary and many types of the pumps and uh, fin, fan, heat exchanger, turbines, generator. So I will sh uh, I will show you all, all about visual looks and their function also. So I hope you will uh, I, 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 my request is to see please this is very a small video but very important and please uh, watch this up to last so this is mechanical pumps you can say you can see here this is a uh, centrifugal pump this is suction and this is impeller now it will rotate and it will discharge from here and this is from uh, will power receive from the motor or turbines so you can say this is also a, a centrifugal pump. You can see here. This is the impeller. You can see this is uh, a split. This is also called overhang pump. This is uh, uh, this is reciprocating compressor. You can see here. This uh, uh, this is many many impeller. One, two, three, four. And a pipe and many because it is uh, cut it up to them I think it is 10 stages or 8 stages so this is very very important actually this compressor it is uh, it is very very important and this compressor will compress actually compressor we are used where we have to compress the fluid and increase the pressure and uh, this, this is centrifugal compressor that's why we, we may say that the centrifugal compressor is a equipment which is used to compress the air or gaseous to increase the pressure and it will inject to any system this is also a centrifugal compressor you can say this is this is suction and this is discharge and this is many stages 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 stages here. You can count this impeller, and this is this will show you the stages of the compressor. This is reciprocating compressor. You may say this is a piston, this is piston rod, and this, uh, this is crankcase. Uh, and, and this is a crankshaft and inside this is crankcase so this is very very important actually the centrifugal uh, the reciprocating compressor we are used where we have to in, increase the pressure and but the flow is very less and in the centrifugal compressor flow is high but the pressure is lower than the reciprocating compressor this is also a reciprocating compressor this is also reciprocating compressor you may see this is this is a turbines this is very very important this is uh, you can say this and uh, this is very large you may see the the five feet human this is you, you see here how much bit here so this is the blade of the turbines and this very very large turbines this is also a turbine you may see this is blades of the turbine and uh, a steam will enter in here and it goes from there this is the sun this is suction This is a generator. This is very important because uh, because of the electricity. By this generator, it is uh, electricity will generate. Because you may see here in another another example. This is a turbine. This is a turbine blade, and it will rotate. Then it will also rotate generator, and it will uh, produce a magnetic field, and then it will generate. And this is a three phase wire will go to the substation and this is a heat exchanger this is also very this is a 
shell and tube type this is very long one from one, from one side cooling water will flow and from another in the tube the process fluid will go and it will transfer actually uh, heat exchanger is a mechanical equipment which is used to transfer the heat either cool or heat of the medium this is also very important you can see this blue is a water medium and this red is in, which is flowing through the tube it is uh, it is it is it, it is process fluid this is this is fin fan actually fin fan is also a heat exchanger but it is air cool heat exchanger so by this way you can say uh, we want if you want to cool the temperature of the fluid then by this way we can cool but this but the rate is slow slower the cooling rate is slower than the heat exchanger this is the heat exchanger in the upper side this is tubes and uh, onto the tubes there are many fin fan uh, sorry there, there are many fins it is small is small is small so by this way we will increase the uh, uh, surface area this is the cleaning of the tubes of the fin fans this is you can say here this main is cleaning this is a valve you can say you can see here this is valve this is globe valve and this is very very important this is wheel this is a stem this water go from here and it produces load go from here and it will out from here you can say this is diagram this is very important this is header this is a stem this is like it for time degree and this is like in that and uh, this is the sheet washer sheet so flow flow in from here and I, right now it is closed that's why fluid will stop there if this will move here then the water will go from there fluid will go from here this is vessel this is a very very important this is also a vessel actually vessel is there are two types of vessel the uh, vessel is the one vessel is uh, high pressure and another vessel is low pressure this is a column this is very important where we have to uh, uh, where we have to uh, extract the material by heat this is column this is also a column you can see here this is heat and if heat then it will increase the temperature and pressure also there so the lighter medium will go up the heavier medium will go down this is very important this is column so I hope this video will help you because we have shown you the visual look and their works, how it works. So I hope you will enjoy this video. If you have some gain knowledge, then please like button, like on button on the video, and please do subscribe my my channel for more information, more videos. Thanks for watching. I will I will meet in next videos.